Hello everyone. Here you are watching Dr. Bipin Kumar, and mm -hmm. as usual, the last year stopper of W uh, S T Water Science and Technology. I have introduced like the Ankit Daya and uh, Vaun Avarma and Vigdesh. So you may be aware. So this video is very useful for the aspirant those are preparing for the Water Science and Technology G R F, and they want to do master in Water Science and Technology. So today, candidate is uh, Mavril. She secured first rank in 2021. So first of all, I want to congratulate uh, Mavril for her achievement. And uh, this is the very good day for the those who are uh, uh, preparing for WST. So Mavril will share his, uh, his strategy and the journey of water science technology preparation. So Mavril, you are most welcome here. And now you start. First of all, uh, thank you, sir, for this opportunity. And uh, I have seen all your videos, which is too informative in agriculture. Um, and coming to my introduction, uh, my name is uh, Kirtana Mavil. Uh, got first rank in uh, Water Science and Technology in ICRJRF examination, which was held in uh, September 2021, as you said. Um, coming uh, to the introduction of my uh, uh, journey or uh, about water science technology the syllabus covering a syllabus is very important for me so my strategy is like uh, covering all uh, the topics in the syllabus and um, which boost me uh, more confidence uh, in my journey uh, one thing and, i want to stop you here Marvel, first of all you tell from where you graduated because you <laughs> you have not given okay. the introduction of the university from where you graduated now okay okay sir so uh, I had my B.Sc. Agriculture uh, in Agriculture College and Research Institute, Madurai, uh, in Tam Tamil Nadu. Okay, okay, okay. So currently yeah. undergoing MSc Water Science Technology in IRI, sir. Yeah, yeah. No, you should, uh, now you can proceed. <laughs> so regarding uh, Water Science and Technology subject, we have four units in our syllabus. So first unit is uh, general agriculture as well, as we all know um, i chose two books uh, for general uh, agriculture first one is general agriculture book by nimrat sunda and second one is fundamental of agriculture by arun kadian which is very derivative and uh, it is like very useful uh, in initial days of practices and um, you know most of all uh, the, the people who are uh, trying for uh, water science and technology uh, we can um, Proceed only the cultivation of uh, um, some of the crops, which is uh, indicated in our uh, syllabus, like rice, wheat, chickpea, and so on, which is in our syllabus. And uh, we can read also other commercial crops, but uh, some of the crops which have mentioned in the syllabus, uh, we, we must know from A to Z of these crops, which is very useful. And most of the question will be asking uh, from this uh, crops only. And um, Coming to the second uh, uh, unit, uh, which is very essential uh, uh, for this water science and technology. And I personally choose two books for this unit. And first uh, book is uh, Irrigation Theory and Practices by A. M. Michael and Soil Water Conservation Engineering by Dr. R. Suresh. Um, the first book, A. M. Michael uh, book, it covers water resources of India, surface and grounds, groundwater resources, irrigation development in India and so on. But personally, I studied most of the topics uh, in this book. I covered all the topics uh, in this book, which is very useful and also very important. Um, coming to this uh, unit, both book back and book in questions are very important. Sometimes they might ask directly to the lines of the book. So... Uh, reading line by line in these two books is very important. Um, and also understanding the concept is very, very, very essential. Um, sometimes they might ask uh, the situation question also. So this time they ask the situation question and also problems, uh, which is too simple. And uh, reading book back question is very essential. And uh, coming to the third unit, which is soil physics and chem chemistry, I um, searched on online and I also study uh, fundamental of soil science by PK Das. And I also I um, use many slide shares, which is too available in online, um, which is very sufficient. And reading DK Das book is sufficient for this unit. And coming to the fourth unit, last unit, which is a diverse uh, unit, and it consists of many uh, mathematical uh, portion like integration, differentiation, uh, quadratic equation, and which might 
we might revise the 11th, 12th portion, which is very sufficient. And also uh, statistics and during uh, our UG program, uh, we might study the statistics and which is very efficient and then the fundamentals, knowing fundamentals of statistics, uh, probability is, is like efficient for this uh, course. And uh, um, regarding fluid mechanics, um, I personally uh, studied on online, but my senior uh, proposed me to study uh, Dr. Vanzal book, which is very fundamental and uh, but that everybody can understand uh, fluid mechanics from this book. So I personally study Dr. Vanzal book, which is very useful for me. Uh, this year, they may ask um, uh, the units regarding units and problems in this might uh, this year, they ask uh, units of viscosity and uh, problems regarding viscos kinematic viscosity. It is very simple, but um, we have to know the concept. Understanding the concept in this area is uh, very much important than uh, reading formula and all. And um, uh, finally, water pricing laws and irrigation acts, uh, which is the last line of the syllabus. Uh, I searched online and uh, in uh, yeah in Google it is very uh, available. It, it has very uh, fast information and we can uh, we can get it very in an easy way. Uh, in a Google you can type for irrigation laws and ads. Uh, this this year they asked regarding uh, Yaguna plan, Ganga plan, uh, the year regarding Yamuna plan and Ganga plan. Um, yeah, reading an online is okay, sufficient for this unit. Um, that's all, sir. Okay. So one thing I want to ask, Marvel, uh, what do you think yes, how much sir. time is sufficient to crack this uh, uh, GRF for in water science technology? Yeah, how, compared how, how, to when other... you started, when you started uh, your means preparation. So it's not just like that, sir. I uh, I didn't get a rank in uh, previous year, so I didn't quit on uh, water science and technology. I quit the year, and I studied actually last three four months. Uh, yeah, and that is very uh, very sufficient for this course because uh, comparatively to the other discipline, and this course have very less uh, uh, syllabus. Syllabus. Okay. 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 Yeah. So we can. Uh, about three, four months is four months is sufficient. very sufficient for this. Yeah, yes, sir. Okay. And okay. with hard work. How, 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 how many hours you are giving per day in three, four months? Uh, three, four months. Um, maybe about five, five to six hours. Five to six hours. Okay. Yes, sir. So doing problem is very important. So okay. analyzing a theory and without practical uh, things uh, might be very tough. So doing problems, fluid mechanics. Uh, is actually a physics subject and we won't st study in undergraduate program. So uh, initially it was very tough, uh, but after studying and after understanding the concept and after analyzing uh, uh, the problems and we get to know, uh, it's very easy subject uh, when you understand the concept in a very easy way. So understanding is very, very, very much important when it comes to uh, fluid mechanics and also in other concepts. Um, for example, uh, in water uh, structures, you might, uh, they have only theory uh, problem, theory uh, is issues. So um, there are also problem uh, in, uh, in that portion. So um, studying theory and also understanding the concept and ready for the problem is like, okay, okay. Uh, which is uh, very important. Okay, okay. So these all problems are available in that book, what you mentioned. No? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That thing I, actually I wanted to ask. Uh, how many questions this year you attempted and uh, how many questions were, what was your score? Sir, uh, I attended, I think, uh, 90 questions. 90 uh, questions. Okay, okay. Yes, sir. Out of 120. But, yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. And I also skipped many questions and many problems. Okay, okay. Uh, because I have no time, so I uh, continue to attend most I can, of the problems. I can understand. Yeah. Yes, sir. So, out of 90, how uh, uh, how much was your score? It's about 50-50, sir. 50-50? <laughs> yes, sir. Okay. Means uh, uh, 45, 45 questions were right, your? Uh, more than, I think, 50-52 questions are right, sir. 52 questions were right. 50 
55 questions are right and uh, we also have negative mark in this so we should have aware of that sir so um okay most of the seniors advised uh, as to select at least 100 or uh, nearly 100 questions but um, but time is a real problem but okay, okay. Uh, yes sir so i don't know only 85 questions okay okay so no issue the thing is that uh, it is not it is uh, does not matter that uh, how many questions you attempted the yes, ma- yes, the things sir. matter is that how many questions you are doing right right and even yes, it is sir. also depend on the uh, uh, level of the question if suppose some of the year questions are very easy and you can go maybe more than 100 but sometime if the problems are more more uh, problematic and lengthy question so it is not possible to go more than 50% question also like the upsc if you go in the upsc yes, question in upsc no can go more than 50% so always be careful and okay so okay, if, sure, any, if anything sure. left so yeah we can interfere only sir so i want to thank i want to thank you sir <laughs> thank you thank you thank you ma'am so for making this video so that uh, everybody could uh, know about this discipline yeah you can say and you finally want to... i want to thank my uh, parents because i quit a year and they supported me a lot so yeah, this video are... i want to thank yeah, yeah. the parents yeah, really, and also really, i want to really, thank really yeah. yeah and uh, i want to thank my senior vignesh uh, sir who is currently pursuing phd in modern science technology uh, who guided me i think he is also from tamil nadu na yes same college same college yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah so okay thank you okay,